Hi, my name is Leanne Phillipson Webb. I'm a registered nutritionist, the founder and author of Sprout Right, Nutrition from Tummy to Toddler. I'm working with TFAL, a brand trusted by moms and dads, to introduce their new line of baby home products, including this multifunctioning unit which steams, blends, reheats, and defrosts your homemade baby food. Starting your baby on solids is a huge milestone for parents and making your own homemade baby food has many far-reaching health benefits. You want to dazzle those taste buds, open the palate with lots of real tastes and flavors, add spices or herbs to your food, change the texture, and also introduce fruits and vegetables that you don't typically find in store-bought foods, such as dried apricots, beets, and parsnips. Apple puree is a firm favorite with all babies and so versatile to add into any other fruit or vegetable and a great one to start by adding cinnamon into as the introduction to a new spice. Apples are going to give your baby not only vitamin C but also lots of fiber and flavonoids. I have my apples here prepped ready to go into my steamer basket and I have peeled it this time. Assuming that I'm giving this to a six month old, you do want to peel the skin off because it does provide too much texture. You want this puree to be lovely and smooth. As your baby gets older, do leave the skin on or just do a stripey peeling job so that it does encourage a little bit of texture and they'll get used to it as they get older. Now that I have my apples prepped, chopped, and ready to go, I'm going to put it into the steamer basket. Now that I've finished filling my steamer basket, I'm going to put it back into the BPA-free steamer bowl. Both the lid and the unit have a dual locking feature for extra safety. The recipe book included indicates how much water to add to the reservoir with this handy measuring unit. For apples or any other fruit, I'm going to fill the reservoir with three measuring cups filled with water. After I fill the water reservoir, I replace the cap and turn the unit onto the steaming mode. Some more great features of this multifunctioning unit is that it's all BPA free, super safe for your baby. It's also cool to the touch, so even while it's steaming, no matter where you touch, you won't burn yourself. There's an auto shut off, so I don't have to worry about remembering how long it's going to take. The approximate cook time for my apples is about 10 minutes. Once my apples are finished steaming, I'm going to empty the steamer basket into the blending jar. If you're making this for a six month old, leave the water in for really smooth puree. For a nine to 12 month old, where you want a little bit more texture and a few more lumps and bumps, remove the water from the blender bowl first before you puree. Pulse until I get to the right texture for my baby. Continue to pulse or puree until you get it to a really smooth texture for that six month old. As they get older, pulse it a little bit less and start to get a few lumps and bumps in there just to challenge that palate. If it's for your nine month old and if you feel like it, add a little bit of cinnamon to it to spice it up. Pulse again if necessary. Mmm, that has such a lovely warming flavor. So good to keep on opening your baby's palate. They're gonna love it. Because of the graduated bowl, I know that I've made about 250 mils of apple and I'm gonna store it in the jars which come with your unit. And these glass storage jars hold about 60 mils or four tablespoons of food. If you're just starting your baby at six months on solids, then this jar should probably last about two days as they may be having one to two tablespoons at each meal. You can store your glass jars in the fridge for up to about three days or put them in the freezer to keep them for longer, up to a month. When warming your baby food, whether from the fridge or the freezer, remove the lid from the glass jar. Place the glass jar inside the steamer basket, put on the lid, put it back onto the multifunctioning unit. 
Put the appropriate amount of water in the steaming reservoir. And turn it to the steaming mode. Refer to your recipe guide for the exact amount of water, whether defrosting or reheating. The ease and convenience of this multifunctioning unit not only saves you money when it comes to feeding your baby, but also starts them on the path to a lifetime of healthy eating.